And then I see her across the bar coming at me with this look, you know? And everybody kind of steps aside for her, like the Red Sea or whatever, just clears the path for her. And I'm like, what's with the nut job? Never seen her before. I was just sitting there and suddenly this lady is in my face. And she's all sweaty and yelling and really pissed. I don't even know why at this point. It has something to do with her boyfriend who's apparently at the end of the bar. I wasn't flirting. I don't even know who she was talking about. So she's all up in my face and her breath is like boozy, but even worse, you know? Like there's something rancid stuck to her, the roof of her mouth, rotting peanut butter or something. And she's harassing me and blowing her stank breath in my face and cussing. You wouldn't believe the words that came out of that lady's mouth. So she's talking about her boyfriend, Augie. Well, at the time, I didn't know who she was talking about because I didn't know he was there, but then I figured it out. Oh, she must be Augie's girlfriend. So she's all, you bitch, you, fuck you, you bitch. Sorry, sorry. F you, you be, and all that. Just talking like a maniac and people are looking at us. So I'm starting to feel self-conscious and she's just going off and I can't really do anything because the place is so crowded, you know? And she's a big lady, so I can't even get around her to escape or whatever, and I'm starting to feel violated, you know? My personal space and my dignity or what have you, so I just made a fist, hauled off, and boom! I hit her. <laughs> Crazy, right? Yeah, right in the face. Boom, I hit her. <laughs> she went down. And then I couldn't get around her and she was screaming. What would you have done? Oh, and you know what they don't tell you? It really hurts to punch someone. It freaking hurts. They don't put that on TV. It's all, no, that ought to show him. But for me, it was like, man, that killed. Look at my knuckles. What?